So guys, this is my Naomi Smalls from RuPaul's Drag Race episode 4 neon runway look and she's got this sort of tennis badminton girl with the pink visor and the neon pink realness and the neon yellow hair. This look was one of my favourites from the show and she is definitely one of my favourite queens from the season as well along with Kim Chi. Naomi is such a good makeup artist so I definitely wanted to do a look of hers and I hope that you enjoy the rest of the video. Oh look at me. So, first things off, I'm gonna first pop in my contacts and cover the eyebrows using my Crip Stick and combing those up. And I'm gonna do a few layers and to be honest, I wanna cover these sideburns up because when I put a wig on, it's so annoying when I see the black and sometimes I'm really, really lazy. But today I'm gonna to cover my sideburns with the Crip Stick as well and set that with powder. After that, I'm gonna take care of my skin using my Nivea Post Shave Balm because we're gonna put a lot of makeup on. And then I'm going to be correcting my beard area using my LA Girl Pro Conceal. This is so good for drag because it covers up all the dark shadows and like all the gray areas when you shave. So this is definitely a crucial step, especially if you've got dark facial hair. And then just blending that in with my toothbrush, makeup brush. After doing that, I'm going to tap in my Kiko Cream Foundation in number 8 and because the sideburns and the eyebrows were covered up you want to be tapping the foundation in because you want to be quite careful around that area and then I'm just going to be applying the rest of the foundation on top and blending that in with my Real Techniques buffing brush as well and I'm going to cream contour with a darker colour as well just because I feel like the other foundation was quite pale and also you want this to be the base of the contour now to highlight I'm actually going to be using pure white I'm going to be using Ben Nye Clown White it's so so good for the nose contour you want to create a little triangle tip and also on the pointed bit of the nose you want to draw a half circle I'm going to also highlight under the eyes with the white as well. But once you blend it out, it kind of goes to, you know, something that looks okay and not too, too white. I'm also going to contour the nose down like Naomi's. And again, blending everything with the buffing brush. I think Naomi Smalls uses a beauty blender, but I like to use a brush. Now for the eyebrows I'm going to be using Ella Masca Brow Gel in Stare and Naomi's brows are so thick and so full and also she does them really straight as well so that's what I'm going to do for my eyebrows and she also likes to do an ombre. Now she's like me, loves to clean up the brow with some concealer, I'm just going to be using Ben Nye Clown White again with a flat concealer brush and redefine the eyebrows with that. And this is such a crucial step. This is one of my favorite steps in makeup, in makeup in general, in drag makeup, everything. Now we go beat the face with some powder. Now you want to apply loads and loads and loads and loads of powder. So you just want to use a powder puff and just beat the face. This is gonna make your face so matte, so flawless, and this ain't gonna move. Like, this is gonna stay forever until you take it off. So, now that we've done that, I'm going to be taking the Sugar Pill Jolly Pop Eyeshadow, which is a neon pink with a Louise Young Pencil Brush, and I'm just gonna carve in the crease with this. And then I'm going to also apply that to the lower lash line, really, really smoking that out. I want loads on the lower lash line. After that, I'm going to blend that through the crease because we want this look to be blended. No harsh lines for the blending, please. Uh, that is just not the tea. Like, you don't want to leave it unblended. And then I'm going to be using Sarah Hill Firestone Eyeshadow, which is a purple. And I'm just using that as a deeper colour, to be honest. And using a pencil brush again just to deepen everything up and of course you want to blend again you 
using Taka White Eyeshadow from Sugar Pill again, I'm going to use that to set the brow bone area and highlight that area as well. Naomi's brow bone looks really super bright in this look, so pack it on. I'm going to be using Clown White again and carve in the lid. This will make any crease into a cut crease and it will make everything so, so sharp. I'm kind of guesstimating the lid look for this look because Naomi's eyes are hooded so I'm kind of guessing on what she's got on the lid but after the clown white I'm just setting with taco eyeshadow again just to make that last so much longer and this is a little tip but apply your gel liner with the back of a brush and honestly it will last all day long and it will have an even application now for the liner, I'm using two different liners, the MUA Liquid Liner and also the Makeup Revolution Pan Liner. And I'm just creating a normal wing and just a little bit thicker than normal. After that, I'm just going to use some mascara to take off the powder products from my eyelashes. And you want to apply some gems, some rhinestones, because Naomi really, really loves to apply rhinestones. So I'm applying one on the inner corner and two on the outer corner. And then for the lashes, I'm applying three individual lashes on the lower lash line to make your eyes look dolly. And four pairs of lashes on top because Naomi likes a thick lash. To be honest, I feel like I should have added more because Naomi likes a lot. Now, for the rest of the face, I'm warming my skin up with an orange blush just because the yellow hair just washes you out so much. And then I'm going to be using a pink blush to just match with the eyes. For the lips, I'm using a neon pink lip liner from Primark and Naomi's lips are upturned so that's what I'm going to be doing for my lips and also they're very, very overdrawn. To redefine that, I'm going to be using Kiko 300 Precision Lip Pencil just to like make them look a little bit more real but still obviously really dramatic because Naomi's lips are massive, more massive than mine are and she still overdraws them even though her natural lips are big. And then... After that, for the lipstick, I'm going to be using one of Le Beau Cosmetiques Matte Liquid Lipsticks and every product will be listed down below. So guys, this is the final Naomi Smalls look. I got my nails on, my pink visor, I've got my pink dungarees and my PVC neon skirt. And I've got my yellow hair courtesy of everydaywigs.com. Link will be down below. And if you want to see more drag looks, please share this video and subscribe to this channel. I even shaved my armpits for the video. I've never done that in my life. Fully shaved, fully clean for the drags. So, till I see you in my next video. Bye, guys.